Hello friends, it is that time of year again. Bikini season is right around the corner and with spring break, summer on the horizon, I wanted to sit down and share an affordable bikini haul with you guys today. I have almost 15 bathing suits under $15 to share with you. As always, links to everything will be down below as well as my coupon code so that you guys can save an additional 15% off your Shein purchase. I know a lot of you guys are looking for more sustainable styles. Perhaps you're looking for something a little bit higher quality on the pricier side. I have a wide variety of hauls across my channel, so I will leave that playlist down below in case you are interested in checking out Dippin' Daisies, Black Bow, Katomi, some of my other favorite high-end brands. But today, I did still want to give you guys some affordable options since I know a lot of you guys are balling on a budget. Without further ado, let's hop right on in. If you guys have been around my channel before, you know I like to go in color order, so that's what we're doing. Kickstarting the haul with one of my all-time favorite bathing suits. I actually have this style in probably five or six colors now. It is one of the best bathing suits on Shein's website, if you ask me. These bottoms have a piped lining, which means they have a thick seam around the sides. This holds everything in place. No sand gets in your bottoms, and these really just sit in place. I love that this bathing suit doesn't have any additional clasps. There's no self-tying strap. Perhaps there's really no chance of this falling off of you. It's one of the best bathing suits if you're planning on being active in the water but you still want a simple tan line. Triangle style top with cups stitched into place. This makes your boobs look absolutely phenomenal. And then the back does not have any clasps but it does have the thin adjustable straps which I really love. I'm wearing a size extra small in all of the suits today. I am about a 34B in the chest, 24 inch waist for reference. I will have my measurements down below. The next bathing suit that I have is a Barbie pink. Pink. My job is beach, so of course I loved this style. Definitely a cheekier bottom, and then the sides to this one just have a very thin strap, so it's going to give you a really basic tan line. And then the top is one of my all-time favorites. If you are a bustier girl, you need a little bit more support, highly suggest checking out this type of suit. It's got that underwire along it, and it's got removable pads, so this is going to hold everything in place and give your boobs a little bit of lift. It's got that silver clasp along the back to hold everything in place, and then thin adjustable straps. Very flattering color and I love that these bottoms sit higher up on the hips. This bathing suit reminds me so much of one of my favorite brands which is called Kulani Kinis. They always have the cutest like tribal prints and little beads along the center of their bathing suits. This small detail makes the swimsuit look so much more expensive and a lot of Shein bathing suits especially in this haul have that small detail so I tried to pick a bunch of them up. This is just your classic triangle string style bathing suit top. I have quite a few of these in this haul so you're going to see this style a lot because it is hands down one of my most favorites to wear. It's extremely flattering. I always get questions on how I tie this type of bathing suit to make my boobs look the way they do. So I'm going to show you guys right now. I will put it on inside out. Then I'll tie it from the back first. So I always tie it in a knot and then I tie it in a bow. That way in case your bow comes undone while you're swimming, you're not going to be topless. Then I will move it around like this and I'll put this strap above my head. This fabric moves along this lower band so you can cinch these cups as much or as little as you want to, giving you a little bit of cleavage. The bottoms are just your typical string style bottom. They are a little bit cheekier in the back and then the front just looks like this. Again, with this type of bottom, highly suggest a knot and then a bow. One of the biggest quality differences between Shein and spending a little bit more money on a site like Aerie, Kulani, Dippin' Daisies is that most of their bathing suits are lined with this white mesh. I don't love that, but that is what you get for paying less than $10 for a bathing suit. This next bathing suit is a triangle dupe. They released a swimsuit very similar to this a season ago, and now Shein has knocked it off. It's got really wide cups to it, so if you have larger boobs, you might like this style. It's got this like pink strap laced throughout it. I've never seen a suit like this and I think it's such a fun detail. Very, very different. And then the bottoms are your typical string style as well. Again, they have that same laced detailing that is just so flattering. Very different, very fun. Next bathing suit I got is the cutest pale yellow. I'm obsessed with this. It's the exact same texture as the last bathing suit I showed you. This one is lined with that inner white mesh as well. And then these sides just are a little bit more neon, which I think is really fun. I won't lie, this one is extremely narrow in the front, so definitely you've got a lot on display with this guy. Might want to wear that the first day that you have a clean shave. Um, the top is just your typical triangle style bathing suit. You guys know I love the string style so much. Just super flattering. 
Cups on this one are a little bit smaller. Just in general, the coverage on this one is much less than some of the other styles I shared, so I would suggest sizing up. If you want a triangle style bathing suit, but you want to skip all the self ties, I cannot recommend this bathing suit enough. This has a fun waffle like texture to it. It comes in a bunch of different colors and I picked it up in the green. These triangle cups are stitched into place, so they're not gonna move around. And then you've got thin adjustable straps. There is a small silver clasp along the back. And this just gives you a very basic tan line. If you have a larger chest, I suggest sizing up on this guy to avoid a little bit of side boob. And then the bottoms just look like this. These are some of my all-time favorite bottoms to wear when I'm having a day at the beach. You've got those thin sides, which gives you a very basic tan line, but I can run around, play in the water without these moving around too much. I'm a sucker for all things seashell. I couldn't resist this triangle bathing suit, so much so that I actually picked it up in two different colors. It comes in a few different ones, and again, it's got that textured feel to it that almost feels like a towel. You've got little seashell accents along the center and along the straps. Bottoms are your typical tie side bottoms. They do run a little bit large, not in coverage, but in the like length of the actual bathing suit. So these ones sit a little bit higher up on my back, which I'm not a huge fan of. I'm not exactly sure if that's like the right way to describe it, but when I turn around, you guys will see what I mean. But love, love, love the color of that, that I still think this bathing suit is definitely worth picking up. I also grabbed it in the white because I just couldn't resist. I love a good white bathing suit in the summertime to really make that tan pop. Super flattering, and this one is not seen through which is a game changer if you guys have ever heard of the company abide they are a very high-end sustainable swimmer brand from Australia and they have the cutest prints this bathing suit reminds me a lot of their styles the print is definitely inspired by that these type of bottoms are super super flattering they sit really high up on the hips and the fabric moves along that lower band so you can spread these out and make them fuller coverage or you can cinch them up and make this practically a thong it just kind of depends on what your coverage preference is as far as bottoms go very very cute i love the pattern of that and then the top to this one is a little bit different than your typical triangle bathing suit it's actually got straps that go straight back and rather than a clasp, it does self-tie, but you've got thin adjustable straps. And unlike your typical triangle style suit, this one actually does not give me a whole lot of lift. It makes my boobs look much flatter, which is totally okay. I still think this is super cute, but just wanted to note that that's why. This is the exact same style swimsuit, just in a different print. I love this blue and white floral. How cute is that? This just like screams coastal Nantucket type of summer to me. I love this. Again, very, very soft material, and this is not see-through whatsoever. Same exact style top, and this one's got a sweet little pearl detail along the center. The cups on this are really wide, so if you have a larger chest, you're gonna be a big fan of this one. I am all for the terry cloth style swimsuits this season. I feel like so many retailers are releasing this fabric, and it feels just like a towel. They dry really cool, and they just feel so, so soft. This is a string style bathing suit bottom as you can tell but this one actually has a lot more coverage in the back definitely a family friendlier style and oh so cute and then the top is just your typical string style I'm obsessed with this one definitely one of my favorites from this entire haul this is another print inspired by Vidi Swim which is the Australian swimwear brand and I love this style top holy cow this has underwire to it as you can tell it's like not moving around this has a lot of structure to it if you have larger boobs this is definitely gonna hold everything in place You've got that thick silver clasp along the back, so it keeps you very secure, and you do have those thin adjustable straps. A very basic style suit. This is amazing if you're looking for a solid tan line and you're just planning on laying out at the beach for a few hours. Bottoms are that same style that move along the lower band so you can cinch these up or stretch them out. And look at that print, you guys. It's just a bunch of like vacation postage stamps, which if you know me is so on brand. I'm a sucker for all of the cherries right now. I feel like these are trending big time and I'm obsessed. This is your classic string bathing suit and adorable. You've got cheeky coverage, definitely thicker the crotch on this one so you've got a little more coverage and then the top just looks like this. The last swimsuit I got was sort of a dud because I thought that it had like your typical size bottoms but it is in fact a thong in the back which I like a cheeky bottom but this is just like way too much for me. 
Love the color though, but order this at your own risk depending on your confidence level and showiness. All right, you guys, that is going to be all for this short and sweet bathing suit haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Like I said, I have tons of other swimsuit hauls on my channel with so many styles that are still in stock. I will leave that playlist down below and here on the screen so that you guys can check out some of those videos if you're still looking for more inspo. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to see more videos like this one, be sure to give us a big thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and stick around. Love you guys. Talk soon.